Why? Why do you care so much? Why do you care so much about what other people think of you? You see, when I when I get on calls with people who want to sign up and possibly join my program, I always dive into their dive into those dive into their situation and ask them a lot of personal questions to see what's going on with them right now. And one of the questions I ask is what has been the biggest obstacle that has stopped you from reaching the goals of whatever goals that you have with your speech, with your expression of yourself? And I'd say three times out of 10, the person on the other side of the call is actually really, really real with themselves. And they tell me it's because I care too much. I care too much about what people think of me. And that is what holds me back. That's what holds me back from taking action, from speaking when I want to speak, from saying the things I want to say, from stuttering openly. It's because I care too much. And now some other people on this call might tell me like about a million different reasons of what has held them back. Sometimes external things sometimes other internal things, but always, always what it comes down to is you're putting way the fuck too much value into other people's opinion of you. That's what holds you back from overcoming your stutter. That's what holds you back from expressing yourself authentically how you know you can you already know you can you can do it in a room by yourself completely fine you know you can already speak fine there's just fucking fear in the way fear of being judged fear of looking stupid fear of being rejected and if we never face that fear, and if we never see there's no real danger in these fears, we believe the story we make up in our mind. And the story we wake up, we make up in our mind is the worst case scenario that never comes true. The story we make up in our mind is the worst case scenario that never comes true. Think about it. The reason why you don't do that present you don't do that presentation or you don't put your hand up in class is because internally you think to yourself, I'll get caught in the block. I will not I no words will come out of my mouth. Everyone will turn, everyone will look everyone will start laughing the teacher would even start laughing i would run out i wouldn't know what to do my face would go red and i'd probably die maybe maybe consciously you wouldn't say the probably die part but subconscious subconsciously that's what you believe and now you don't put your hand up and guess what you have no other choice but to believe that fucking outcome that would have happened if you put your hand up was that worst case scenario of everyone laughing at you and you dying. How tragic is that? Every time we avoid, we are believing the worst case scenario that will never fucking happen. No wonder we are so scared. No wonder we hold back so much. 
because we simply care too much about what other people think of us. The biggest improvement in my life I have ever made in my speech, in my expression, in my relationships, in my sex, in my authentic connect connecting with other people is learning to be me 100 fucking percent 120 fucking percent 120 percent authentic and not needing to bend to other people not needing to please other people not needing to prove myself not needing to be perfect not needing to pretend like i'm feeling something that i'm not feeling right now what i mean is i don't need to pretend i'm not anxious i'm fucking anxious sometimes you're anxious sometimes but anytime you try to hide that and act like it's not there and you're lying to yourself, you're lying to other people, there's a mistrust, there's a, there's a miscommunication what's going on and you're not acting authentically. You build tension and you stutter more and more and more. This process is, a, is about becoming the most authentic version of you and the most authentic version of you does not care what other people think of them. Of course, there's always a line with this, right? You can't be a fucking psychopath that has no care at all. But it's now selective. You, it's, I used to be so stifled just walking down the street or in a grocery store or at the gym random fucking people i was giving them so much value i was giving their judgment so much value so stupid so fucking stupid now the people in my in my life that i care about their judgments of me have earned it have earned it and they are someone who i who i want to be there's someone who i look up to in some way they have earned my fucking respect. Until people have earned your respect and they are in a position where you would want to be, do not fucking take anything they say as a reflection on you. And even when people are, are in a position that you look up to, still question if this person is speaking from a, an emotional, temporary spot or from a spot of love stop caring so much what other people think of you it is holding you back it is stifling you it is stopping your growth to overcome your stutter stop caring so much about what other people think of you i love you